2019. Can you believe that? 2019. And we are, we have a lot of things planned for the channel. We have some short films, we have some DIYs, we have some tutorials, we have some tips. We have all kinds of things planned out for the channel. So stay tuned for, um, for what's to come on Ladybug Film Productions YouTube channel. This was actually requested before I made my last scheduled video for 2018. Um, this lovely viewer asked, hey, I noticed that you use a Ripple T6 and I have one. Can you help me with the camera settings? Sure doll, I'll help you with the camera settings. Now, my camera settings, I actually um, use the same camera settings as Darius Britt um, that he used with his Canon 60D. No, I don't know the dude personally, but I think he's awesome. You should go check out his YouTube channel. In fact, there it is, right there in the description. Click on that, go check on his, go check out his stuff. And, um, you know, maybe he can give you some tips and stuff in filmmaking, just like I do. Um, he also makes short films and he is very talented, so he's worth checking out. So go check him out too. Um, but I have a Canon Rebel T6 um, DSLR camera. I'm actually planning to upgrade to a Rebel T6i, but I'm gonna keep my T6 because it's my baby, it's my first, and I love her so very much. She doesn't have a name, so she's not quite as special as the bunny bunny, but what can I say? She's my baby. So, camera settings, the Rebel T6 and the Canon 60D can have the exact same camera settings. In fact, if you have a DSLR camera, you can do these same camera settings. What you want for your um, for filming on your Rebel T6 is movie recording size 1920 by 1080 at 24 frames per second. Why 24 frames per second? That is actually the industry standard. The 24 frames per second. Recording, manual. Metering timer, 60 seconds. Exposure, zero. Pitch style, neutral. Leave it flat or neutral because when you go in and you do color grading and color correction, it actually makes it easier to pull the colors out of a neutral than it is to have some sort of color, some sort of color filter on. So leave it at neutral. We use manual focus. We do not use autofocus. Autofocus is for if you're not really doing films, but you're doing something like a YouTube video and you don't want to really have to sit there and play with the focus. But for filmmakers, we use manual focus. Please, please use manual focus. They stress that in film school. People who do this for a living stress that. So I'm stressing it. Use manual focus. You need to have the stabilizer on. Um, it will help you when you have footage and you're using it handheld and it might get a little shaky or you're using a gimbal or a shoulder rig or something and it might be a little bit shaky the stabilizer will help stabilize that a little bit but you can also go into your editing software and further stabilize that the iso it, it it's the same as photography with iso it depends on whether or not you're outside 100 to 200 is a standard for outdoors because you can either have a bright sunny day like right now or an overcast day with the sun 100 to 200 is great 800 is should be the max for indoors unless you're for some reason at a concert and you need to bump that up 
but 800 is the absolute max so you don't get digital noise on your picture. Your shutter speed should be at 1 50th of a second. That will help with motion blur and things of that nature. Now I'm going to show you some footage that I took on this camera using those same camera settings. settings um, will be placed in the description below as well as you'll be able to find them on the Ladybug Film Productions Facebook page. Don't worry about it. It will all be fine. I promise you people that. Um, but this was a short video on camera settings and if you like this video please click the like button hit the subscribe button click the bell so you can get notifications of whatever we make new content that includes the short films the tip videos the diys and everything that comes out on this channel including special announcements short little contests things like that because i'm planning to do a lot with this channel in starting 2019 because this is a thing. Um, go over to the vlog channel and see behind the scenes footage. See me talking to myself on a camera. See me capturing my family, even when they don't want me to, on camera. And just get a feel for the daily life that goes on here at Ladybug Film Productions. As well as my time in film school. Um, and I will... See all of my wonderful, beautiful, lovely ladybugs in the next video. Also, while you're here, check out Creepy Santa and my other short films that I did. And I will see you guys next video. Remember, be kind, be brave, be awesome. Now, go out mwah, and create. I love you, my ladybugs. Bye. We are the music makers. And we are the dreamers of dreams. Thank you.